What message are you bringing to Silicon Valley? Well, first that Nigeria is open for business. We're all set to go, especially with technology. His Excellency said Nigeria is open for business. Africa is open for business and Wakanda is open for business. What does impact look like for next play? Like, when can you gather this group of amazing young professionals and put them in a, in a space where together they can start thinking about ways they can have a huge impact, whether on the continent or off the continent or anywhere where they find themselves. And, you know, this is kind of a really cool manifestation of that because I can only see from the connections being made that they are really interesting opportunities. So what we do with that youth population is going to make a tremendous impact on the world for good or for ill. Mm -hmm. I think it's the duty of leadership to ensure that we get it right mm -hmm. with the training of young people so that they can take on that responsibility of leading the next millennium. Yeah. When the glory comes. That was beautiful. Excellent. Excellent. Connections in next way in Africa, some you know, supporting some kind of you know effort. You know, I think there's some interesting opportunities, and I think that you know this event is just a, a one door, and that would enable next way open multiple other doors, um, and it's going to be exciting to see where you take it from there. But I, I ultimately feel like events like this, where there's real impact and there's connections made about an issue that, quite frankly, I don't know anyone who is from the continent who isn't thinking about home all the time, um, no matter how connected or disconnected you may be. Training and teaching is going to be technology driven. Yes. And we may not have uh, the sorts of classrooms that we have today. So we're already thinking through how to deal with that. Mm -hmm. So how do we deliver education to young people without necessarily putting them in the sorts of spaces that they have today? I think it's just awesome what you guys at Next Play are doing and you guys really just got to keep it up. Uh, the continent needs the work that you're doing and hopefully having more leaders come through. You know, I don't know how you top this one. First of all, I want to say a huge thank you to His Excellency for gracing us with his presence tonight and with his team. They've been very busy, lots of very tired people and they still made the time to be with us today. Um, I also want to say a big thank you to LinkedIn for hosting us tonight. Thank you. Thank you for being such a magnet for opportunity and for talent, especially for Africa and for supporting us. Um, finally, I'd like to thank all of you who have come here to grace this occasion tonight. Thank you so much for taking the time to come and interact with us and learn um, you know, about the government's plans on talent and our experiences investing in talent. And before I leave, I'd like to thank Thugori for making this event happen, Leslie from Next Play for making this event happen, a whole bunch of other folks, uh, too many to mention now just for um, making sure this came together as nicely as it did. Thank you so much, um, and I hope we have a great night. Thank you.